4x cube plus ax square minus bx plus 3 divided by x minus 2 leaves remainder 2 divided by x plus 3 leaves remainder 3. Find the remainder when it is divided by x plus 2. When polynomial meal of x divided by x minus a, then the remainder is p of a. This question is a very simple question. If we call this as polynomial in x, we are being told that p of 2 is 2, p of minus 3 is 3, and we need to find p of minus 2. What this is? Very simple question. Use these two, you get equations in a and b. Find a and b, plug them together into this, and you can find p of minus 2. Fine. Why are we doing this question? Because you need to be you need to know the funda and you need to be careful about plugging in the values. Nothing more than that. I'm going to go over this methodically. Divided by x minus 2, remainder is f of 2 or p of 2, shoot 2, 4 into 2 cube, which is 32, plus 4a minus 2b plus 3 is 2, or 4a minus 2b is minus 33. 4a minus 2b is minus 33. 32 plus 3 is 35, 2 minus 35 is minus 33. On division by x plus 3, remainder should be f of minus 3. So it is minus 108, 4 times minus 27, plus 9a plus 3b plus 3 is 3, or 9a plus 3b is 108, or 3a plus b is 36. So we have 4a minus 2b and 3a plus b. You can write this as 6a plus 2b is 72. Add these two, we will be able to get a. So if we add the two equations, we get 9a is, is 36 plus 72. Give me a second. We add these two, we get 10a is 39, not 9a. 10a equals 39. I'm just going to go over this again. Add these two, 10a equals 39 or a is 3.9. Plug A is 3.9, we get B is 24.3. A is 3.9, B is 24.3. It's a painful question because of the numbers. There's nothing to this question conceptually. We need to plug in these numbers into finding X, F of minus 2. So this is minus 32 plus 3.9 into 4 minus 24.3 into minus 2 plus 3, which is equal to 35.2. Very doable question, probably a question that you should go for, especially if the exam is even slightly tough. But you've got to be very methodical and get it right. Fine. Very simple, nothing but a direct application of polynomial.